are in Butlin's Minehead. I have not been here since 1987. Things have changed, but I did get a massive flashback of nostalgia. As soon as we hit the seafront, it was crazy. It was just like, bang, I was back. So, um, yeah, we've literally just got here. Some time to kill before we can get our rooms. So this should be interesting. So expect some nice apartment reviews in a minute. It's a step up from the caravan reviews at Haven. And this is, um, this is us for the next five days. And it's definitely half term because I wouldn't take my daughter out of school during term time. Jack's already got the football out. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> It's very nice little central complex. Beachcomber. I remember the original Beachcomber. What is that, it? Well, it was, a, it was an old pub back in the day, which is absolutely amazing, but obviously that's not it. But hey ho. <laughs> little playground, little climbing thing over there. Well, Marnie's going to go on that tomorrow. Kentucky gift shop. Oh, that's nice. Look. Crikey. Good God, I didn't expect that. Look, I found Crikey. We need you to you win it. We're going to have to try and win one of them in a minute, in a minute. Not at the moment. We're going to find something to drink before I die. Certainly is big in here. We have a table. Go on, race. Yes. Yes. Maybe. Oh. Breaking the new camera, slow zoom. Ah. Forty-two. That's really good, man. So, this table has been sanitised. Has it really, though? Has it? Oh man, you're losing points here, Butlins. Really? Yeah, I've already filmed you, Reese. I've already filmed you, you'll see it when you watch the video, but I already got you. Crap. That's why I didn't Ab know. Absolute rubbish, Laura. They are the tough ones to get those two, aren't they? <laughs> Cause went down well. Now on the thatch's haze. Look at the cloudiness in that. Nice. Oh, daddy's, go daddy's going for it. Oh, I got that on video as well. Utter, utter failure. Embarrassing, <laughs> I'm, I'm a disgrace. Yes. Oh, that's pretty good. Yes. What am a girl? In the food court. So we got one feature of stuff. I'm going a bit crazy. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna have one of them as well. Oh, Wesley Parks. Good God. You know what? I could get used to this. That's awesome. Oh, I just got a bit of everything, you know. Is it nice? Well, you haven't tried it yet, obviously. I forgot that it's taken quite nice. Mm. Oh god, that's hot. So, I'm eating now for the first time today, so I'm sober. But, um, yeah, in general, that was quite a nice eating experience.
What do you reckon, mate? What do you make of the food? It's dry. It's a bit dry. Yeah, it's a bit dry. We've been sat around on the heat. It's crazy. It's nice, though. But it's good. It's good enough. This is part of the all-inclusive... Um, we paid for... We paid out front for all this. And uh, literally, I just helped myself to anything, so... Yeah, a moderate thumbs up. Where are we, man? It's the apartment review. So, we are in Shallows Creek, although on the um, form it says Swallows Creek, so it took us a long time to find this. So yeah, typo. So we're in number four, so we're going through here. Could do some paint work. You can put the key card in. Well, right. Does it go that way? It goes down like a key, yeah. Put it down, pull it out. Now we're open. And we are in Oyster Bay S4. And here we are. Right, we're not going to be too long about it, okay? Oh, look, Wes. What? I just realised what I've done. What have you done? I've washed my hair in this. Yeah? It's a highlight activating thing. You've done what? You've washed yourself in a highlight activating thing. That's why your hair's gone all fuzzy. That's why it's activated the bleach on the bottom right. of my hair and it's gone like bloody sore. Could this have waited till after the apartment review? Hmm, okay. <laughs> we'll start again. Okay, so the light bulb is working. Over here we have some hooks which look like an angry octopus ready to fight someone. Drunk. Don't they? Drunk, drunk. drunk angry octopus. There's a mirror with some sexy guy in. Right, we're gonna pop straight into mirror. your Momani's room. We've got the twin here with a little of those happy days at Butlins on the wall. We're not gonna spend too long doing this because my, my caravan review's not gonna go on for ages. And this isn't a caravan, it's an apartment, but it's not the point. So over here, we've got Gulliver. Gulliver's still coming on trips with us all these years later. Um, he's been under the bed. He's been under the bed for the last like six years, has he, man? We've got um, a door. Nomi's just been around spraying everything with Dettol. She wasn't too happy with um, any of the um, any of the um, any any of the cleanliness. It just looks a bit okay. So yeah, it's it's a door. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. So that's the that's the twin room. We've got a light light. Does the lights work? Neon lights work. There's no outlets in the room at all. There's no outlets in this room, which is very, very strange. Um, going to the main room. Outlets in this room? There's not, is there? There's no outlets in this room. All the outlets are in the main room. Uh, another nice little... Uh, the pillows are so comfy. Comfy. <clears throat> another nice little vintage uh, Butlins thingy there. Over here we have a mirror and a... We've got a nice little view outside. Hmm, okay, okay, the tech draw. In here we have a wardrobe with, oh my goodness, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight coat hangers. Marnie, eight coat hangers. Yeah, and uh, one, two, three, four shelves, which is good. Okay, and we pop into, hi. See, that's what you get for using the wrong thing. You just buy the expensive one thinking it's gonna be the best and it's not appropriate. Okay, so we have the shower room with latrine and um, and a sink and um, what you'd expect to find I'm really. Stuck. Marnie's stuck in the shower. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a shame if someone turned that I'm on? Actually stuck. Yeah. Okay. No, please help. I'm stuck. Yeah. Remember that video we were watching last night and they said you, you you can get stuck in these if you don't. <laughs> Nay, our daughter's stuck in the shower. Nay. Our daughter's stuck ah. in the shower. Anyway, I'm gonna finish this up. I'll be back in a minute. Help. See you later. No. Nay, our daughter's genuinely stuck in the shower. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, you got it. Do you want to know how to open it? No. No. Listen. Yeah. Push it. Push it outwards. No. I'll do it again. You basically pull that. Yeah. Okay, so anyone watching this, uh, I hope we've we've saved a we minor incident there. Yeah, that's pretty bad. I bet this is a heated towel rail. Let's have a look. Towel rail does stroke can get hot it does and it can it does and it can okay this light can go out please be aware spring-loaded door Ooh. no stand back and let me show 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 the spring-loadedness of that door yeah that'll take someone's fingers off in a heartbeat that can go off and we are into the main room area don't let that door slam it'll get really annoying for the people upstairs okay we've got a tiny tv it was the ones on the the ones on the other videos we watched them were, 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 were bigger. Nomi's been at it with the anti-back. 
I take it this is your doing down there, no? What? Oh, he's streaking yeah. marks. Okay. Um, yeah. These chalets have not had a look of paint in quite some time. Okay, we've got some nice Butlins. Yeah, great one. Uh, Butlins holidays, wonderful. More vintage. I like the vintage stuff. That's nice. And and um, oh, we've got a we've got a cupboard here. What's in here? Is that the boiler? No, you can't open it. What do you mean you can't open it? It's literally shut. <laughs> Okay, we have an iron, we have an ironing board, we have sources of electric, we have a dustpan and a brush. Oh, the door's a crime scene. Yeah, that's wrong. Yeah, it's, it looks like people have died in this room and the cleaner has not done a great job of body disposal. Oh, jeez, what the actual? Got a table, chairs, adequate. Yeah, that's fine. Nice little wooden floor. Carpet state. Has anyone noticed the state of the carpets? They seem okay, don't they? Actually, yeah, that's fine. This bit seems There's quite like new. Let me just have a look out here. I, mean, I did actually look at the car. Oh, okay. It's a bit trodden out here, but that's what we expected. It's the hallway. Bedroom carpet's not too bad. Hold on. I'll show you how to open the um, shower. I'm, I'm rambling now. So we've got the couch. Let's give it the comfy test. Mm. It's not great. It's all right. It'll do for now. Okay, we have a bin. We have alcohol and water and a day microwave. And we've got, all, you know, that, that makes it all better about the crime scene door. We get some little sachets of PG tips and stuff. Um, glasses, four, four. Um, plates, four of each. Cups, mugs and all that. It's a bit mismatched. Okay, so we just line up the mugs? I quite like... This is gonna play havoc with my OCD. Look at that, that's our matching mugs. Yeah, not good. Um, water flow, it's good. I'm well, not gonna try the hot. Yeah, it's good. Um, hmm. We've got, we have a cooker. Cooker is generally kind of clean. I, I guess that's okay, actually. It's better than the one we got at home. Um, down here, sorry about the whipping around of this camera, I'm just trying not to outstay my welcome on this video. We have a toaster, some bin bags, some, uh, no, 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 no. the space used on that shelf seems like an awful waste of space. And we've got um, no leaks. We have, brace yourself, an Ice King with a two year guarantee. Um, we've got water in the freezer for some reason. I'm guessing that's my wife. And we have a fridge full of water as well and coke and, and milk and yeah, stuff. Um, first impressions are, yeah, it's all right, it's all right. So what, what do we make of this place? The bathroom is quite nice. A bit pokey, but it's like, no, nah, it's all right. This is a silver accommodation, by the way, a silver apartment. What did you just say? Would you like to speak to YouTube? Yeah, we were looking on UVH yesterday, but I don't see if they have hairdryers here, but they don't. We were, we were looking to see if they had hairdryers, because I was saying, don't bring a hairdryer, you won't need one. They're bound to have hairdryers, because Haven quite often has hairdryers. And then was like going, no, what if they don't have hairdryers? Then we'll be without a hairdryer. I said, well, it's better to be without a hairdryer, probably wouldn't have two hairdryers, that's just overkill. Long story short, we brought a hair... We brought a hairdryer, and it's a good job we did, because they didn't have a hairdryer at all. So we have a hairdryer, we have one hairdryer. So I want to you know, says, Apology, because you said... Don't threaten me with a toothbrush. You have you... Have you noticed there's no outlets in any of the rooms apart from the front room? No um, Electrical outlets. Minute. Plug sockets, nay. No. No. Molly. Yeah, there's none in my room. There's none in there, none in there. It's crazy. Ah, seagull across there. Yeah. It, ah. Now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reserve judgment to the end of this video. It just... It could do with a bit of love, couldn't it? Some of this. It, a new door. Definitely get rid of this door. I dread to think what sort of hell this door has been through. I really feel sorry for this door. If I was like an empathic, I could probably pick up lots of stuff off this door, but I'm not gonna. And things like that, it's just, uh, no. So we're okay for now. This video has gone on for, holy God, 11 minutes. So I'm turning off now. So that's our. Um, apartment review for the silver accommodation in Butlin's Whitehead and um, so far so meh
Hello. Welcome to Butlins. Your room has been cleaned by Linda. Linda, I think you've done a pretty good job, but it was kind of an uphill battle. But I think you've done pretty well considering. So, Linda, you get my seal of approval. I think you're probably a bit too heavy. No, you're in a you're in a dip, man. Stand up. Go on, push away. Push away. Now sit on it again. Go on, you big child. Go on then, off you go. Come on. There we go. Ah oh dear. Get some speed behind it. get my seal of approval. They were good, they were very, very good indeed. Day two. What did everyone make last night? I thought the entertainment was all right. Seems quite COVID safe, I would say. Maybe not the arcade, but I mean with the staff and stuff. You know, that second venue we went in was immaculately clean and well looked after. And um, 
There we go today. All right. Okay. The what? Yeah, okay. There's a lot of people in there. Right, we're off um, swimming now, so no cameras in the pool, I would imagine. And then, um, breakfast first, isn't it? So, we'll do a time cut of a review of swimming to see how swimming was. We're going swimming, and this is what we thought of it. Two hours later. We returned. That was a decent swimming pool experience. The breakfast, probably could have done without before we went there, but it was all good. Breakfast was okay. Bit of a queue. Swimming pool, good. No, no footage of the swimming pool like some strange YouTubers have because it's just not acceptable, really, is it? So, um, uh, yes, um, good. Do you know? I think you might have missed Judge Robin, Lady Marion. Well, maybe I have. Um, what kind of porridge do you have? For you, Lady Marion, any kind of right. you like. So we're at the fairground now. Well, this is very unexpected. I didn't expect this to be outside that door at all. That door. This is nice. Go for it. Just go. Hold that. Mum, hold that. <laughs> Just go, Mum. Oh, we still don't know if it'll be big enough. Go and see. What's he trying to go on that thing? Oh, he's he's sort of like uh, on the cusp of heights for things, isn't he? There's Marnie up there somewhere. <laughs> oh dear. That looks horrifying. Yeah, that looks awful. She's putting what? Wait, right, that's, yes, for the, the sake of the video. That is the old splashdown. A lot of splashdown, the sun splash, which is an old defunct um, swimming pool thingy, which was erected in 1986 and shut down in the 90s. So I remember it, and it's still there. It's used as an irrigation system or something. And it's full of moldy water. Oh, we got duckies. I didn't realize duckies were going on. She's getting a ducky. She's trying to get the one that keeps laying over, laying down. Oh yeah, it's probably every time, isn't it? Yeah. What are you going to have, Emily? Uh, Billy Supreme Helter Skelter. So there's Marnie, right over there, over there. Okay, here we go. Where's Marnie? Where is she? There's Marnie. There's James and that one. <laughs> I don't know if James is spinning that, but that's hilarious. Let's watch. Look, the speed is going. Are you tall enough for this ride, Laura? Smile, go on, get in. Smile. Smile. Yeah, I'll do a proper picture. Right, Reese. Ready for this? Yeah. Ready. Let's do this. Can I touch the wheel? See, but didn't fit me. It doesn't fit me now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear, just you guys. What makes you think that? <laughs> Cheers, man. No, come here. We're doing the complaint to the buttons. Their, their um, seat belts didn't fit us on the bumper cars, and I feel fat shamed. Butlins is fattest. We never had this problem at Haven or anywhere down Bowlees. This is disgraceful, <laughs> and you're getting one star at TripAdvisor. <laughs> uh, on the plus side, we won't get any spinal injuries today. <laughs> this is quite uneventful, really. I'm quite disappointed. That was like pretty embarrassing. Are you not embarrassed, like? This is going on YouTube. We've just fat shamed. No, we've been fat shamed at Butlin's Minehead. This is um, 
this is not good enough. And I, we've been on Slimming World for eight months, <laughs> and I'm down six and a half stone, and I still don't fit in one of these posse cars. From, from my all-time high, yeah. Wow. This is disgusting, but this mine head. And grrr. They're not, they're not driving right, but they're actually driving sensible. Yeah. She's gonna get one in, she's gonna get one in. I'm very disappointed by the lack of bumping. Head on bumping. Oh, look, oh, get her, get her. Marnie! Get her! <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, I feel like I just coached Laura into that. I said, Don't, you can't let your son down, Laura. <laughs> I feel a bit bad, I've just done that. Yeah. <laughs> Is she not good at these? You alright, guys? Are you alright, Laura? Are you alright? Oh dear. <laughs> She's not happy. I feel like I may have pressured her into that. Nah, she's alright. Oh dear. I know, that was a bit much. She's alright. She's fine. She loves it. She's a big kid, really. There's Barney. She's fine. I'd do that. If a goddamn seatbelt fit because Butlin's fat shames. Fat shaming Butlin's mine head. This review has just taken a dark turn. It was going so well until Butlin started with all the goddamn fat shaming. I don't care if people looking. Butlin's, this is not cool. You're fat shamed. You can't do that in 2021. Oh, really? Ow. Where's Laura? Oh dear. So you feel all right? Laura, you feel all right? Oh, yeah, all right, thank you. I just need proof of that. <laughs> All the mirrors, I think so. We have just stopped off to get eight tasty donuts. Tasty, tasty being the opposite word. So, Butlins, because you fat shamed me, I'm now having a relapse. And uh, this is undoing all the, all the body magic I've been up to all week. It's gone now. Why did you just put your donut on the table? Because of, I don't care about COVID anymore. Because of, because I've been fat shamed by Butlins. Absolutely <laughs> disgraceful. Haven don't fat shame. Mm. You don't mind that. Well. And so much so you've even put my wife off of eating a donut. Oh, I say that. She's about to eat one now. Oh, it, oh no, she, that's hot. she's relapsed as well. You've relapsed. You've ruined our slimming world because of your fat shaming antics. Not cool. Not cool. Something I just noticed. Yeah, look at this. Butlins does not cater benches for the larger, robust person. <laughs> Butlins we is just chock full of fat shaming. I want more donuts. <sighs> hey, Granny, I got that fat wood. <laughs> This um, this is an unnerving sight, really. Hmm. It's a winner. Oh, mate. <laughs> right, Yoda, you are coming with me. Come on. Oh, that's rubbish. He's never going to be mine. You know what? I'm starting to think these machines might be rigged. Oh, it's getting violent on this one. Go on, Jack, take it down. Yes!
We've got an ice cream already, yeah. So we've got back to the food courts. Fish, cakes, and chips tonight. What's your beetroot stroganoff like? Yeah. Nay. Okay. Um, let's go and try it. Come on, try it. Let's have the review of the beetroot stroganoff. <laughs> that face says it all. No, give me a bit. Go on. Dad, you should get some of this pasta. It's not too bad. It's alright. It's alright. Someone in my class, Mum. Need to get a picture of me with this. James gambling here on camera for proof. <laughs> State. Oh, it's even nice. Oh my god, Marty. I think you got too many coins for your cup there. What are you gonna do? Hmm? I'm not sure about the physics of that going down there. Hassle. Come on, Grogu. Ah, oh, rubbish. Mm. I need this baby odor. Found him again. Do you keep sneaking away from me on purpose? Hmm? What? No. They're, they are not worth 30p, man. Yeah, I know, but they're worth like five pence and you want to pay 30p. That's not good, man. You're falling for the scam, man. Don't be. No, I tried again. You'll see me fail. What's the chicken thing all about? Oh, how you doing, Nay? Alright. You keep running away from me. <laughs> I got some tickets for you. Oh. I won I won and found some. <laughs> you got that right in my face, I hope. I know. I'm not in a good way. It's because we snuck that beer in that Lee, Lee and Nick bought me. What was that flavour? Ice cream. Ice cream? It was quite unique, I'll give it a laugh. Emily! Gorgeous! <laughs> oh, I remember when I 
used to fit on these things. <laughs> What? Oh yeah. Oh isn't it? I don't know if the camera's even picking that up, but my goodness. That is some interesting colours. Ooh. Fire. Why is it in the ground? There we go now. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Heart burning. Mm, I'm so rough a bit now, so we need to get in that place and um get absolutely wrecked. <laughs> nice. Very nice day for the footage. So we're approaching the end of night two. <laughs> night two went pretty well, I think. We just watched the comedy club and they were alright. What did you make of the comedy club? They were okay, weren't they? Funny. Yeah. Um, that vodka probably shouldn't have what? arrived at the table. So, um, yeah, we're going to make it wait. We'll see, we're going to see if anywhere's open for food and they have drunk food, which is best food. What did you say? No, I'm oh, good. You want to what? Sorry? Are you doing a TikTok? <laughs> yes, I'm on the TikTok. I'm on the TikTok, man. They won't delete that. They use it. I'm WJP666. God damn it. Oh dear. I don't know what's going on. My family's just forsaken me. They've gone. They've gone. I'm on my own here. I don't even know where I am. I'm awesome, mate. You need to know this. <laughs> where is everyone? Hey, we can take our masks off now, Reese. Where is, where's our families gone? Where are they? Where are they gone? We're here. Oh, hello. Did you see the boy? I'm on a TikTok video apparently. Did you see that? It was, it was decent. It was mass. I believe so, yeah, it was masterful. Why did you I, I don't, well, yeah, it was an opportunity I couldn't turn down really. That's, that's absolutely pretty, that's lovely. I like that. That's not real foliage though, that's Christmas tree yeah, foliage. It's like born for Christmas. Yeah. Alright, where are we? No meat. <laughs> do you realise? Laura, do you realise how obnoxiously squeaky that pram is? Jesus Christ. Alright, we're here. We made it home, so that's, just, that's a bonus. We're in. We're in the house. We're in the house. We're in. We've locked Mama. <laughs> we killed Mama. Thanks for that. What time is it? Stop. We got cheesecake now, which we stole from the all you can eat buffet. Shh. We're gonna have some cheesecake now. Love you, everyone. You're awesome. Love you too, Daddy. Delicious. Love you, Mum. Morning after. Good hangover cure is to go and eat a full English breakfast, followed by an hour of swimming. It should be interesting. Three hundred and forty-six minutes later. Yes, please, Keith. I'm an espresso. Or well, best you can do with it. Then. So we're back from swimming again. Swimming pool gets a lot of votes. It's a little run down in some places. Needs of uh, I don't know. Needs some. Needs some paint. There's paint. I don't know. It needs stain removal here and there. But in general, the pool's alright, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. Good. The pool's okay. Naomi's over there. We just got back and uh, 
making some lovely coffee, which at this point, if she just put instant coffee in a cup and didn't add water or milk, it would still be better than the coffee they've got on the site here. The coffee here is atrocious. I don't know whether that's just because I'm a coffee snob these days, but I don't know. Do you like the coffee, Nay? No, not really. Coffee no. is a half star out of five stars. Um, swimming pool's good. Um, oh, um, uh, what's next? What else? Yeah, we saw um, they got this big slidey thing in the pool. Um, we go down on a dinghy and we saw two people, two large people, um, get stuck there today and they had to be hauled out with some rope. So this is another example of Butlins not accommodating for the larger, huskier framed person and this is more Butlins fat shaming. Definitely. We haven't had a lot of fat shaming. With yesterday's shenanigans and now this to see those poor, huge people get pulled out, <laughs> pulled out of the dinghy by a rope. It's just degrading and Butlins, you need to do better than this. You can't fat shame in 2021, it's not fair. So hopefully, if we get through the rest of the holiday without any fat shaving, we'll see. Actually, but I did ask, what? That is one thing you can get away with in, in this year. What? Fat shaving. I know everyone's everyone's pretty let themselves go in, in lockdown. And um, um, yeah. So we're going off to see Peppa Pig next. Whether we'll make it is a mystery. And oh, you've got a spider on your hair. I've got a spider on my hair, where? Money spider. Oh, show the camera, show the camera. Spider. Spider! Oh cool, well, do I make a wish or something? Yeah, cool. cool. Also, I asked for an extra sausage today in my breakfast and I got a very, very odd look off the guy serving them, which um, <laughs> I think again was fat shaming by Butlin's yeah, staff. Thought it was a type of um, sausage. No, I just asked, I asked for kind of an extra sausage please and he was like, he just looked at me like, you fat. So I think honestly, Butlins does have a problem with fat shaving, but we're gonna we're gonna carry on. Um, most of the red coats I spoke to are nice though. I quite like the red coats. Oh, that's disgusting. What's the disgusting? Water, the water in they left the water in the steam iron. Ooh, that could have been in their ages. That could have been in their ages. It's only gonna get turned to steam. I don't know why you're getting so wound up about that. Anyway, that's my review of the swimming pool and the fat shaving problems on site and Nomi's impromptu review of the iron. Um Tune in later for full review of the ironing board, which is there. Adjustable, so they're going to be wibbly wobbly. Right. Have fun, guys. Well, I don't get the feeling this is going to end in catastrophe. That's <laughs> just undercut Reese. See you in a bit. Hopefully, they'll be back in one piece. Here we have the dodgems again. Should we go back on there after yesterday's experience with the fat shaming? And you elbowed that guy in the face with your big chubby arm that wouldn't have a belt go around I it. Am not <laughs> We're going to watch the video. This video is going on YouTube now. In fact, let's do an instant replay now. No. <laughs> and there it was. What? Oh, they're back. What? They're back already? Had a... They could just come by us? Oh. I'm confused. Look at that, they're not that heavenly. What's the blue one? We've got our ice cream, but Nomi's just turned up. She's over there looking all angry at the door because we didn't get her one. Now she's got a big queue to wait. We're going to sit over here and enjoy our delicious ice cream product. You got your money, it's fine. She hasn't touched she anything. She has. She doesn't. Oh, Karen's on the rampage. Uh, part of the ice cream club. No, I dropped my spoon. Naomi, not so much. Hey? Oh, okay. 
I love gift shops. Lanyards. Dance Academy, got some lanyards. Is that fridge magnets? Oh, love this stuff. My favourite of this was the obnoxious one. Um, nay. Is that the one you said have bad lip sync? That's what you said. And this is a Sportacus ripoff. I don't know how they got away with that, Butlins. My goodness. Go on, do it. This time. I got a feeling. That's good. That's good. Drop it. Oh, I went. No? Uh, ooh. Oh, no. Left foot up to the next one, man. Let me know then. Come on, he's not even left the floor yet. What are you doing? Keep going. <laughs> oh, God. Ollie, you better go. Just <laughs> let go and walk down, man. That's it. That's it. Yes. Yeah, well awesome. <laughs> Face. Spider Man. Spider Man. Oh, wow. wow. Look at her go now. Go. Bloody hell. Good God, Marnie. You're fine. Well, you don't have to. You just get up to it and touch the face. Your right one is on your knee. <laughs> <laughs> you can do this, Marnie. Go on, Mark, put the right one up, you're fine. Lift your right knee up. Your lip, you, on this angle, you can let go of your hands, not go down. Lift your right knee up and you see that. That's it. Lift your right knee up, you're fine. Lift your <laughs> I love that. Other one. Other one. Uh. You're on the stone. Now, now lift your other foot. Right leg up, babes. Go on, back off then. <laughs> Hang on, man. Hang on. <laughs> Oh, boy. You're just there. You can do it. Let's touch the side the other way. Yes. Got it. Oh, man. Hell yeah. What a man, awesome. Well done. That's it, man. Yes. Yes. Shh. Be quiet. Be quiet. Don't put a big deal on her. It's bad enough I've got the camera on her. Oh, bless her. <laughs> oh, bless you. It's all about time. And she's coming down. That's good. Marnie, that was amazing. High five. Okay. I need to be there 15 minutes before. Basically. No alcohol today yet. I'm being good. I say good, I'm eating my weight in whipped cream. Not gonna lie, that's pretty good. And Marnie's back at it again with her daredevil stuff. I don't know where she gets this fearlessness from. There she is, my brave little soldier. Oh dear, dad anxiety kicking in.
no means panicking right now. Oh, she's getting hooked up now. She's getting hooked up. Oh, it's just got real. Oh man, she's all, she's nailing it. She is nailing it, man. Good on you, man. Big step. There we go. World's most awesome daughter right here. Go on, mine, you got this. The faith. She's got this. She has got this. She's awesome. Oh my god, she's awesome. She's got this. She's got this. There's her mother over there having a massive anxiety attack. Ah, oh, kids are just a never-ending stream of anxiety attacks. You got this. So, that's part one over, now it's the high bit. How are you feeling now? I'm excited. Nerve, nerve excited. Okay. Right, we'll just, this will be over in a couple minutes. We can do this. Okay, Marnie snuck out. Marnie snuck out. Without us even seeing she's done that bit already and she's up there. Yeah, she's up there now. Yeah, she's up there now. Yeah, she's up there now. She's up there now. Yeah, she's up there now. She's up there now. Okay, I did not see that. Let's see how she gets on one of these bits. Come on, Marnie. Good girl, good girl, good girl. Yes. One more step and you're halfway, really. Yeah, she's got this, she's got this. Come on, Come on. just let it till, just let it till. It's wibbly wobbly, but it's good. You've got this. You've got this. You've got this wibbly wobbliness. You've got it, wibbly wobbly, she's down. And she's there. It's my daughter's legs. She's coming. She's coming. Good girl. She's got it, she's got it. She's nailed this. Yes, you got this Marnel cake. You got this Marnel cake. Come on, Marnels. <gasps> yes! Come on, please. She's got it, she's got it. She's got this. She's got it. She's got it. Oh my god, she's got it, she's got it, she's got it! <laughs> oh man! That was anxious! Oh, wow! That's fantastic, how did you do that? I don't know, I mean, that takes some serious balls! My god! I can't believe you just done that! Oh, I need vodka now. Jesus Christ. You feeling all right now? Yeah. I'm actually trembling. <laughs> oh. I don't know how she done that. Wow. Marnie! That was amazing! <laughs> <laughs> well done. Really making the most of everything today. Caught myself a child from all go with it. Mm -hmm. I've earned this after that stress of the high wires. Back at it again for Grogu. That's the trouble with that bit, yeah. So we got a pirate themed crazy golf just like Weymouth. I know that hole is pretty intense, look at it. You got the little thing down there. Ah, that looks alright. But it's probably just a little bit too close to home, so we might not bother. Got laser laser tag going in there. Love it. I do like the pirate golf, that's done really well. The one at Weymouth is bigger. And some of these got bubbles. Oh, it gave me so much stress earlier. So we are at the beach coma. 
Mm. Adventure Play Park and the Beach Coma Inn. I think they took the park out twice. Is it the original Beach Coma that used to be here? I just can't figure it out. Two at a time. Well, we could go two at a time. Yeah, they've given us four cups for this picture. How silly, silly people. But it is wearing. That's got to be the dark fruits, isn't it? And not too strong. Yeah. Go on. You got to fill your own because it's a manly thing to do. Cheers. And every minute it's at a hundred pounds. That's. It's not. That's really good. That's us as well. Christ, we're all. It's all happening now. Sorry. Got your picture of wine there, Laura. It's not my picture. You're gonna drink that all yourself, Laura. <laughs> yeah. Got your glasses in your hands. Walking around like proper British tourists. <laughs> Look at us, our disposable plastic, non-biodegradable cups. Uh, oh well that's that's hardcore. I'm too bloated, I had too many, um, I had, I had too much to eat at the, yeah. All right, Nay? Yeah. Love you, Nay. I only had one, I had one today. They're quite nice, though. What? Oh, I had a, oh, we had one. Yeah. We were passing ice cream shot. I had a, um, honeycomb one. Had, uh, Scoop uh, ice cream. Ooh, that nice. Highly recommended. <laughs> Not sure about her vocals. I know that you and I, we got better things to do. I don't know who you are, what you do, where you go, and you know. trying now to get this goddamn yoke. That's not bad. That's not bad. That's not bad. Oh. So we've lost a member of the group, which is a bit worrying. We expect it to be one of the kids, but it's my wife. She's wandered off in a strange state. She had to do two glasses of wine and she's vanished. And we can't find her anyway. found respect for red coats they got so much goddamn energy it's either energy out of positivity or speed there's no in between don't let them in don't let them see be the good girl you've always had to be reveal don't feel to let them know
restoration. The cow never bothered me anyway. Boo! You suck! Come on, Chloe. Come on, Chloe. You've got this. You've got this. This is um, Studio 36 or 9 review with Wes and Reese. Reese, what do you think of the show tonight? He ran away. <laughs> you did? You disappeared on us. You scared us all. I went to the toilet. But you scared us. But generally speaking, how was the show for you, Reese? Bad. Bad? I sat here knowing all the answers and no one looked at me. I was going to say, I knew a lot of the answers and no one was looking at us at all. No, it's just wrong, mate. No, they keep asking people, but we, but we knew most of the answers. Yeah, I thought it was okay, but they should have come to us first for the answers, because we would have nailed that. Okay, Lion King. Lion King? Lion King. What are you saying, Lion King? Dad, your breath stinks. Oh, the answer. My breath smells like rum, dear. No, it just stinks. Because I'm a pirate. Reese is gone. Just, just review with Wes now. Oh Reese is back. Yeah. Back. Review with Wes and Reese part two. Uh, He's gone again. You. Review with Wes part two. I think we're all going. Um, Bye. See you guys. And oh, no, I'm coming with you. Bye. See you in a minute, YouTube. Oh, somehow we're the stragglers. We're never stragglers. We're always first day. Eh? I'm not a straggler. Don't straggle me. They run. Catch up with them. You can represent the Parks family. Jesus. Jesus, it's my last day of drinking because I've got to drive home in a couple of days. So, so um, no more drinking tomorrow. So I made the most of it tonight. So this is, um, so yeah, um, but this is cool. Oh, there's people. I'm going to be careful. There's people. I'm going to be quiet. The Butlins is cool. This is better than Haven. And it, it brings back memories of nostalgia. And I'll tell you what, I've got so much respect for Red Coast. Those, those people are, Jesus, they are goddamn cyborgs what they do. Honestly. I'm not a straggler, stop it. You're literally sprinting tonight. Well, it's, it's what Rosé does. I've recorded. It's recorded. This is on YouTube. Laura. How much glasses of wine do we have? Two and a half? Two and a half. Like two, and a half. two and a half litre. Two and a half boxes. No, no, no. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is supreme. Naomi. Two and a half. Naomi. Check this. Check this out. <laughs> oh. I'm doing drunk or easy because uh, it's honest when you're drunk. <laughs> Things need sprucing here and there. But in general, it's all good. It's a good place. This gets the WJP666 seal of approval. It's good. And the nostalgia is good. And it's good. It's just good. It's good. Cha-ching. That didn't work. Cha-ching. Oh, is it working? All right. See you later. See you later, piss -head. See you later, piss head. <laughs> See you later. Nine ish tomorrow. Alright. See you later, guys. Nine ish tomorrow. We left the lights on. This is not eco friendly. I'm turning this off now. I mean, this, this place is good. This gets the Parks family seal of approval. It's not perfect, but it's good. Ah. Uh. First time I've recorded breakfast because we're not going swimming today. You right now, you're a bit hungover. Uh, fry, please. So, yeah, I've gone a bit crazy. I've ordered double everything. There's no way I'm eating that, but I'm going to try. You're not having the bacon, but you got some fried bread. She's a monster. <laughs> we are at Butlin's production of The Little Mermaid, which is very Disney copyright wary, so don't expect any Sebastians or anything like that. You right there, Reese? Very 
So they can't use Disney songs, but they're using Sidney Lauper. Does this butch bit of masculine sea life remind you of a family member? Disappeared to the shot and Marnie's already on it. There she is. Oh, Reese is over here. There's Reese. <laughs> Why is he doing that? <laughs> He's got a weird technique, I'll give him that. Three, John. <laughs> yes! <laughs> You'll be all right. <laughs> up, yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, So that was the waltzers, and um, nay, yeah. that is not designed for fat people <laughs> well, because the heavier you are, the faster it goes. Really? So once again, this is an example of Butlins fat shaming oh, the, the bigger people. Not again. Another ride designed not at the fat people because that was very traumatic, and um, Butlins is fattest. So these lunatics are trying this one again. Oh. See, this is another fattest ride. If I got on there, there'd be a catastrophe. Butlin's fat shames and it's not right, people. Where's the Mel family? Oh, there they are. Say hello, Mel family. Jack! Hello! Jack's at the front. Uh, see, the spinny thing again. I just don't do the spinny thing. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Come on, have your picture taken with the bear. Oh, Marnie, you're getting too old. So, um, we've got gammon and chips today with pineapple, and Reggie's got some too. Here's Reggie. Reggie's sat in the chair next to me. There you go. That's for you, Reggie. I might help you with that one in a minute. But yeah, there we go. So much food. So much food. home tomorrow and I have to drive I'm doing this all without alcohol this is gonna be torture Do it! Dang! 
<laughs> Last one, Shy Grogu. So we could have bought 50 of these by now. Come on, Grogu, come to me. That's not good. Oh. Oh. I hate this game. Screw you, Grogu. I'm glad Kylo killed you at the Jedi Temple. Decent Frankie Valley tribute act. Didn't expect it to be that good. Didn't realise I knew so many Frankie Valley songs either. So how's everyone feeling on our last day at <laughs> Butlins? We're going home tomorrow. I'm a giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> so there's gonna be a full review, a full car review yes. at the end of this video. What are you doing? What? It's weird. It's gonna be a full review about this place. We've got some good, we've got some bad, but in general, I like this place now. What do you reckon? Good? You happy with this? Yeah. Overall good experience. And I'm completely sober tonight. I've done that Take Back Tribute band. Completely and utterly sober. Whew, that was tough. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, Jesus. Right, well that, that concludes our last night at Butlins. <sighs> Kinda of sad. Helper. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Come on. Oh, dignity. She, she's so graceful, my wife. Now push her, push her. There she goes. She's in. I know it's easy, man, but this is your mother we're talking about. Yeah. Well, might just chill out here for a bit. It's quite nice. It's quite nice. Help her out, man. Oh, please stop. <laughs> <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Come on, lay out you go. Why are you pulling her out sideways? That's not going to help matters. Go on, pull her out the front way. Go. Nay. Nay. She's trying to help. That's how you do it now. Now jump down. There you go. Come on. You need to step right back. Let's get, do the same what you've done just then. I tried to come out on the motion. Come on then. Let's the see if... Okay. Yeah. Don't disappoint all your 900... <laughs> Hang on, hang on, man, come out, Dad. <laughs> come out, Dad. Okay. No, no, get his legs. Get his legs. Come on, get his legs. Come on, give it, pull him. Come on, oh, get, have some dignity, you wears. Right, look, I've got another, I've got another touch. 
Dad. Oh, no, I've got another technique. Watch it. I'm going to call this the rolly twisty technique. Okay, ready? All right. Ready? Oh, push on the back. See? Nimble. On my feet like a cat. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, last night in the, in the in the little flat lid. However, I've had a bit of ingenuity. Trolleys are super hard to get when we got here. I'm worried they're going to be super hard to find tomorrow. <coughs> so I've stolen a trolley <laughs> and hidden it in the in the front room stroke kitchen diner thingy until tomorrow morning. And it's ugh, it, it looks like a tetanus hazard. But tomorrow, everyone will be like, "Where's all the trolleys?" And I'll we'll be like, we got one. So, yeah. Yeah. Last day, I've got the men in the ant infestation we've had all week. Uh, and it's nice to see they spent all day sanding that, um, that balcony stair thing yesterday. So it's like some of the run-down parts of this place, they are making an effort to sort. Now putting everything back together, we find all the outlets. Oh well. Uh, do an OCD check before we go. Whole corner full of black mould. And look, another outlet. <laughs> I'm an idiot. This, uh, this radiator is as old as the park, I think. I want another outlet. Oh, for God's sake. Finding everything with my OCD checks. Whoa. I don't know like it's been dusted up there in a year or two. Oh my goodness. Ooh, ooh, sticky, sticky. Wake up, we're going home. We're going home. Oh, last breakfast. Mm. Ah. There she is. Ah, she wants you to take a picture. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye! Got Marnie a woof woof because she loved the show so much. There's a woof woof for Marnie. She loved the show, that's why I bought her rainbow. She loved it, she really enjoyed the shows, didn't you, Marnie? Yeah. And, and I, got, I got you a growl growl. Have a growl growl, there you go. I got you a growly bear. Because it's got Butlins 2021 written on it. It's a little keepsake. I got you Binky the bear and you got a woof woof. And you've got 500 tickets and all you've got to show for it is some squishy tad. Oh, bargain. We really spent our money wisely this week. Thought we'd check out the seafront before we leave. I don't think I've ever actually checked out Minehead Seafront. There's, um, there's Butlins. And here's the sea. Okay, I've got to be honest, that is, um, that's a nice beach. That's a nice beach. That's a nice beach. <sighs> Wrap up video time. So that was Butlin's Minehead and our stay, which lasted five days. And it's, um, uh, what, what month are we in? We're in June, 2021. Some COVID restrictions, still waiting for Boris to lift the last bit. Okay, what do we think of the COVID restrictions? Um, how, how was it all? The people were idiots. Okay, so the staff were great with all the COVID stuff, but human beings guests i'd say about 50 percent maybe 45 percent were not wearing masks were not adhering to anything literally sneezing all over you it was, it was crazy at points um so yeah that was really really bad uh but it's probably hard to police i mean so many idiots around it's unbelievable but anyway i'm not going to dwell on that um as a, a park i'd say in places it's quite run down um the cleaning regime needs tweaking it wasn't really up to our standards however it's not bad by any means it just just needs a lick of paint here and there but there's a lot of it little bits of rust here and there and little you know just little tweaks that need to be made it needs modernizing um what did you think man of the accommodation and all that I liked it. it was good yeah it wasn't bad i've been in worse caravans and uh had worse holidays but you're paying that bit extra you just expect a little bit more but no i can see like the, the big rusty monstrosity sort of railings outside where we were uh, first time I clocked it as soon as I got here and I thought well, we need to sort that out but they started sanding it yesterday so obviously things are in process here in progress so um that'll work um 
In general, the entertainment was very good. They had a Take Back tribute band, which I knew I was going to hate, but even they were okay. So, um, so Naomi, what was your favorite part of the holiday? Um, you can look at the camera. I don't know, to be honest. What was your favorite part? Getting kicked out of the um, the um, bumper car. Oh yeah, probably that. Yeah. Fat shamed. Yeah. yeah, that's yeah. um. And I'll get about the fat shaming in a minute. I just got one last thing to say about that. Um, what what did you like? What's come on quick? We want to wrap uh, this up quick. I don't want to I long. I don't know. All right, I need your daughter. What's your favorite part? You woof woof. You got a woof woof because you're a great big kid, aren't you? So what's your favorite part? Swimming pool. Okay, so we didn't win a baby Yoda despite pumping about 100 quid into it. Um, in general, very positive experience. Uh, be interesting to come back when the COVID things aren't here because everything was pre-booked. But no, very positive experience. I'm not going to rate it. Let's just say we had a great time. Uh, but <laughs> Why aren't you going to rate it? I just don't rate stuff anymore. Just rate it? Uh, banana. There's the rating. Oh, banana. Right. Banana out of watermelon. Do you want know what Reese would say? What would Reese say? Chicken nuggets. He does say chicken nuggets a lot. Um, no, it was really good. Um, sort of knocked the hell out of Haven and all those other places. No, it was good. Really enjoyed it. And um, But yeah, we'll be coming back after the COVID thing. And um, Anything you want to add, guys? I'm going to wrap this up really quick. We've got to, we need to drive back to Weymouth now. So, Nay, final words. I haven't got final words. Jeez, you're a bundle of joy today, just aren't you? Just leave me alone. I'm tired. Come on, can you just say something to the yeah, camera? Yeah, it was great. What bit? Really, all of it. What's your favourite part? I didn't have a favourite part. Jesus Christ. I didn't have a favourite part. Well, I'm not talking to you anymore. You're off my channel. Marnie, hmm? favourite parts, come on. Just give me something to work with here. Your mum's giving me nothing. Um, um, oh, this is in one take. I'm not editing, so just spit it out. I'm trying to think. Probably the, um, so the swimming pool and the rope thingy the rope thingy yeah you've done awesome on those rope thingies one thing i will say which is disappointing going back to this is butlin's fat shames um you, you've seen the rest of the video you saw what happened literally i just wandered past the red coat then and i said have a nice day and he spat on me slapped me in the face and called me a fat <laughs> it was ridiculous butlin's that's the most blatant form of fat shaming i've ever seen <laughs> Okay, so we're going back to Weymouth now. Highly recommended. We will be back. Final words? Mum. Bye. Oh, don't freaking put that on. No, I won't. Oh, That's please. A, that would have been a big bleep and no one would have a clue what Marnie just said there. Oh, she doesn't use She doesn't use profanity, so it was nothing like that, but it had to be bleeped anyway because it was Can inappropriate. Can you bleep that as well then? What, the F-bomb you just done? Yeah. Yeah, that'll be bleeped as well. Oh, oh shit! I'm gonna bleep that as well. Jesus! Stop my ear! Stop my earring! <laughs> Child friendly, mum. We we yeah we don't want to get it taken down. Thanks for watching. This has been our Minehead Butlin experience from the Parks family. Bye. Oh. Bye. Bye. Why did you put me on there? What the hell am I meant to say to anybody? What do you mean? You always put me on there like I'm meant to have anything to say. You're still rolling though, if there's something you want to add. There is it! There's something you want to add. Don't ever assume the camera's off there. <laughs> Never assume that.